Hey there, Internet friends. Trevor Starkey here with another episode of What I Feel Like Friday. Uh, Take two, because I already recorded this video once, and then I went to go and upload it or edit it and found out that my mic had conveniently been turned off. So that was annoying. Uh, So here we go with take two. Uh, Basically, uh, I wound up... I came into it not really knowing what I was going to talk about because it's just been one of those weeks. I came home from work and I've uh, just been kind of playing Far Cry 5 a lot, um, but I was, uh, I did have the, the Let's Play Spring Break going on in the background, and I had that on at work a lot today too, um, and uh, and so that's what I wound up talking about. Uh, I re-upped my first subscription for that. Um, I had... I think I hopped in for, like, as a first member for the Let's Play reunion. Uh, so basically, whenever Kind of Funny goes and does, like, these live stream things with them, I hop in and, uh, and give it a shot. Uh, I was a little more disappointed with this experience, um, uh, just because I think technologically there were a lot of hiccups. I think, I mean, based on what I've seen, and I'm admittedly not an avid RT user, uh, but it looked like they've been, they've definitely been doing some overhauls in terms of the website design and, and their uh, live video player, maybe. Uh, definitely kind of seems to be heading much more in the direction of a Twitch clone kind of thing. And uh, uh, definitely needed some, it still has some, some bugs, maybe. It was, there was a lot of uh, lag or freezing on the stream, um, I think, uh, in large part due to the kind of uh, increased bandwidth from having uh, everybody kind of tune in for this live event, uh, especially from like a lot of the Let's Play family of channels um, who might not otherwise be joining, like me. Uh, and then also I tried, uh, when I found out, oh, there's the, there's an RT app, okay, I'll try it, see you there. Uh, I couldn't make it through more than like a minute or two uh, with the live video going before the app would just crash. Uh, so uh, I was, yeah, a little, little disappointed on that. Um, if I were to rate it on the Google Play Store, it would probably be a one star because I couldn't watch the thing I was trying to watch. Um, but I got home and, uh, and and was able to throw it on my, my laptop while I was playing uh, Far Cry on my, my uh, big TV and... Uh, yeah, it was fun. Uh, I had a good time. And the thing I kind of ended up uh, shifting towards in, in my uh, video, uh, the first take of it, was that I appreciate that Greg, I think more than Greg Miller, I think more than anybody else at, uh, at these events, sees it as an opportunity to try and bring in new audience people um, because he's out there obviously always kind of shilling and, and you know, he does it in a tongue-in-cheek fashion, but he's out there always, you know, reminding people, kind of funny vids, kind of funny, youtube.com slash kind of funny, or kind of funny games, uh, kind of funny.com slash store. He's, like, constantly kind of doing that. But also, above and beyond that, he, more than anybody else uh, that I saw in, and I, I had it on most of the day, um, uh, was really engaging the audience in the community, um, either through the, uh, the chat or... Um, uh, more often, I think, through the, like, Twitter hashtag, um, he would, he was scrolling through Twitter and kind of taking questions and engaging with the audience in a lot of, like, the back, behind the scenes kind of footage and stuff like that. And, uh, and I didn't really see that from a lot of the other, uh, kind of personalities there. So, uh, I, I think that he's, uh, that's, like, he's just right in his comfort zone and right in his wheelhouse there and, uh, and just it definitely stood out as like okay he's doing something that none of these other people seem to be doing um and uh, and i hope that it uh i hope that it kind of uh has positive results i hope that it you know i hope that kind of funny picked up a few new uh um uh potential patrons today as a result of uh their activity at this event so that's what i ended up talking about and and have kind of re-talked about hopefully with my mic working this time we shall see in a few minutes. Uh, so let me know what you've been up to. Let me know what you're up to this uh, Easter weekend or, or if it is Easter weekend for you or holiday weekend or whatever the case may be. Uh, let me know what you're up to in the comments below. As always, I've been Trevor Starkey from trevortrove.com. You can follow me at Snarky Starkey on Twitter. And until next time, from here at the Trove, treasure your friends.